the best thing that you can do every single morning is wake up and meditate. Maybe you gotta wake up and go pee or poo first, but after that you meditate. That's the best thing to do, man. You wanna just let everything in your head just settle down. Just calm your mind, calm your heart. Maybe start feeling some gratitude for at least being alive or waking up. But just sit and meditate for at least five minutes. I mean, if, you're, if you've never meditated before, meditate for one minute. Set a timer on your phone for one minute. You can do that for sure. And just that one minute, you might think it's, oh, it's pointless, what's the point of that? It's futile, just a minute. Man, meditating for a minute is not futile. If you can meditate for one minute, it proves to yourself that you can meditate for two minutes. And when you can meditate for two minutes, you prove to yourself that you can go for five minutes. And after five minutes, man, you start reaping some major rewards. But it's baby steps, right? Like if you've never ran in your life, and you're like, oh, all these people start talking about these benefits of running, but I've never run in my life, but I need to get the benefits, so I'm gonna go run a marathon. You're gonna set yourself up for failure, bro. You don't wanna go from zero to hero. You wanna get off the couch and maybe you wanna run 500 meters for the first week. It's the same with meditation. Start with a minute. That's the best morning routine to get into. The worst thing you can do, but you don't wanna put much attention or focus on to this point, but just be aware of it. The worst thing to do is wake up and check social media of any kind, whether it's Snapchat or Instagram or Facebook or Gmail or the stocks or something. Like You don't wanna check any notifications. You don't wanna put yourself in reactive mode. You don't want to be in reactive mode. You want to be in creation mode. And you can create your day by just sitting and meditating and just be aware of what thoughts come to you and just say, hey, what's up? And then just return your focus back to your breath. The best thing to do in the morning is meditate, man. Been doing it every morning. And the days that I don't do it, man, I feel very differently. I feel very differently. And it, the days that I don't do it are usually the days when I'm traveling, like I just get somewhere new. I'm out of my routine a bit, but it's just like brushing your teeth, man. You gotta get back into it ASAP or those teeth are gonna go sour. So if you're not meditating, man, your mind is just not gonna be as good as it could be. So now you know the best thing to do in the morning and the worst thing to do in the morning. Maybe another good thing to do in the morning too is if you're next to your loved one, just give them a kiss, give them, show them some appreciation. Say good morning, beautiful, if they're already awake. But yeah, you don't want to be consuming content right away either. Like even if it's like a good book or something, you want to be in output mode. You want to be in creative mode. Output is the name of the game here, guys. Output, output, output. You are a creator. You know everything you need to know anyway. Maybe every now and then you could afford to have a reminder. But you don't need to be consuming things first thing in the morning. Spend the first 20 minutes, 30 minutes of your day like brainstorming out what you want to do. Write some goals down or write a little like love letter to someone or something or prepare prepare like a youtube video or something just like create something output 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 design use your creative abilities you are a creator but you don't want to consume things first thing in the morning focus on output 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 this will be the biggest game changer for you it has been for me you can eat a raw food diet all you want you can eat the best watermelons in the world the best mangoes in the world but if you're waking up in the morning and checking notifications you're putting your brain in reactive mode man and if you haven't Set yourself up first with a calm mind, like with some meditation. Or if you haven't like flexed your uh, creative abilities, then when you start going into reactive mode, you're gonna be weak. You gotta build up a buffer first, man. Build up this buffer of good energy with meditation and creative output. And then check your notifications from Snapchat, Instagram, Gmail, Facebook, all that stuff. But definitely not first thing in the morning. And when you do finally check those things, honestly, like, I don't even check my notifications. I don't check Facebook notifications. I check my Snapchat messages. I check my Gmail messages. But I don't scroll through Instagram. I don't even follow anyone on Instagram. I don't check my Facebook notifications. I keep those things maxed out at 99 notifications. And when I do scroll through Facebook, which is rare, I allow myself like one or two scrolls max until I snap in. I'm like, oh, dude, I'm scrolling. I'm gonna stop that. So even midday, man, you don't wanna be scrolling. Your time is better spent on output. Come up with video ideas. Come up with nice things you wanna say to people. Come up with some projects that you wanna work on. And just focus all your time and energy on that stuff, man. 
if you want to be lazy, if you want to have one of those chill days, then sure, watch like a YouTube video, but make sure it's like something that's going to make you laugh or put you in a really good state of mind or inspire you. But definitely no dark gossip, horror, shit like that. Focus on stuff that makes you feel really good about being on this planet Earth. All right, thanks so much, guys. I'm going to head back home now. And I'll see you in the next video. Woo. And if you guys are in Amsterdam this summer, definitely hit me up. I'd like to see you in Amsterdam. Check the links in the description for more information. It's the, uh, it's the gray key. No, it's just the key with nothing on it. Just the normal, standard key. Yeah, that one. Yeah, good. So it just goes in there.